Welcome to Power Yoga, Living with Meaning, day 24 of the Empowered series. Let's get started in a kneeling position. Feel free to sit on a block if that's helpful. Rest your hands on top of your knees, your thighs, close the eyes. And living with meaning is ultimately about bringing our attention to others. See if you can bring to your mind, your heart, somebody that you know in your life right now that is struggling and somebody that you would like to send some good energy to. Could be an individual, could be a group of people suffering from war, or natural catastrophe or hardship. And in whatever way feels right for you, see if you can dedicate this practice to their benefit, to their well being. As the poet Maya Angelou said, to reach for the stars is ambitious, but to reach for hearts is wise. Take a deep inhale through the nose and then out the mouth, exhale, let it go. And now we flow for them. Go ahead and come to all fours tabletop position. On an inhale, drop the belly, extend the heart forward and out. And then on the exhale, round the back. A few more like that. Inhale, drop the belly, slide through the gateways of your shoulders. And then on the exhale, round the back. One more time, inhale. And exhale. Come back to tabletop pose, step back to plank, upper push up. Take a moment to find the diagonal from the heels all the way through the top of the head. Shift forward, take a good by inhale there. And then exhale, lower slowly down to the mat. Cobra on the inhale, float that chest up. And then down dog, exhale, tuck the toes. Draw the hips all the way up and back. And there it is, you guys, the first down dog of the class. Before you know it, You'll be in the last down dog of this class. So make sure that you suck the juice out of every moment that you got because before you know it, it's all going to be gone. Take an inhale, press back, down dog. And then on the exhale, walk your feet forward to the top of your mats. Flat back, inhale. Forward fold, exhale, feet spread out about the width of the hips. And then inhale, rise and float both arms up overhead. Interlace the fingers, turn the gaze down. And then on the exhale, come up onto the tips of the toes, lift the heels, hold there for a couple of breaths. So a little toe balance, a little activation for the calves and the heels. Take one last inhale there. And then on the exhale, lower slow the heels to the ground as you bring one hand to heart one hand to belly, living with meaning, connecting to that heart. From here on the inhale, reach those arms all the way up. And then exhale, forward fold, melt all the way down. Flat back, inhale. And then step back to plank pose, lower down on the exhale. Cobra on the inhale, allow the breath to lead the movement. And then exhale back to your downward facing dog. In a gentle but effective way, we open up this body just by starting to move with a little bit more rhythm. Inhale, press back, sink in till it feels good. And then on the exhale, walk those feet forward, spread them, width of the hips, flat back, inhale, spine parallel to the floor. And then exhale, forward fold with gravity. Inhale, rise with lightness and levity and buoyancy. Interlace, palms up, look down. On the exhale, lift the heels off the ground. 
Lower the heels down as you inhale. One hand to belly, one hand to heart on the exhale. Bring those arms back up to the sky. Inhale, upward salute. And then exhale, forward fold, come on down. Flat back, inhale, stretch the spine out. Step back to plank pose, lower down with strength. Inhale, bend that spine with sensitivity. And then exhale back, downward facing dog. One more round of those, inhale, press back. And then exhale, both feet top of the mat. Flat back, inhale. Forward fold, exhale. Inhale, rise and reach both arms all the way up. Come up onto the tips of the toes, exhale. Heels down on the inhale. And then hand to belly, hand to heart on the exhale with meaning. Good, inhale, both arms up fold all the way down like a moving prayer flat back on the inhale step back to plank pose lower down through chaturanga on the exhale core strong and then inhale slide the body through with finesse and then exhale back down dog Beautiful, now let's move on from down dog forward to plank, setting up three yogi style push-ups. Inhale, lower down, hover. Exhale, press up. Remember when these used to be hard earlier on in the series? Inhale, now you're just doing them all day long. Exhale, press up, one more time. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, drive up. Take an inhale, plank. And then down dog, draw the hips up and back. Take an inhale, down dog. And then on the exhale, both feet forward, top of the mat. Flat back on the inhale, feet together this time. Forward fold, exhale, bend the knees. Sit back and then chair pose. So both arms come up and then hands to prayer in front of the heart, left elbow to your outer right knee, right thigh. Coming into a chair twist. Now option to stay here or side crow. So side crow, both hands to the right, fingertips face the right. And then as you're ready, just lift your knees on the ledge of that left tricep. Keep breathing. Little arm balance. Good feet back down onto the ground. And then back to chair. Inhale, both arms reach up. And then forward fold, exhale, let it go. Flat back, inhale. Exhale, step or jump back. Vinyasa. Cobra up dog, inhale. And then down dog, exhale. Right leg up, inhale. And then right foot top of the mat, exhale. Crescent pose. Inhale, both arms up. And then warrior two, turn to the left. Straighten your right knee, right leg. Turn your right foot in parallel to the left. Flick your heels in, point your toes out. Sit down into that horse stance. Take the right arm underneath and around that left arm. So wrap and spiral. On an inhale, lift the elbows up and then come over and down to the right. Inhale, complete the circle. And exhale, over and down. Inhale, back to the top. Exhale, over and down. Hold there for the inhale. And then let those arms flow down and out, exhale. Reach the arms up to the sky on the inhale. And then hands to prayer on the exhale. And now we offer. Inhale, hands forward. Open those arms out wide and exhale, palms back together to the inside. Two more like that. Inhale, the gesture of offering. Exhale, palms together. One more time, inhale, forward and out. And then exhale, palms together. Hold there for the inhale. 
Straighten the legs, kick the heels out, arms spread out wide. Turn the right toes forward, line the feet up heel to heel. And then on the inhale, reach out to that right arm. And then right hand down, left arm to the sky, triangle pose. Good, now we're gonna keep the left arm lifting up into the sky on purpose. You're gonna keep it lifted up for this transition. Start to bend the right knee, and then half moon. Shift up onto that right foot, right leg. Establish the root in that bottom right leg, right foot. Open up the left chest, and then extend your left arm forward and out. So extended half moon. If you want, you can also take your bottom right arm and reach that forward and out as well. Left ribs turning open to the sky. Through it all, the breath in the flow. Good, right hand down, left arm to the sky, little bend in the right thigh, float step back to warrior two. Reverse the warrior, inhale, come back. And then exhale, windmill, both hands down to the mat, pause. Spin onto the back left toes and bring your right leg behind you, three-legged dog. Keep your right leg lifted, crawl your hands back by your left foot, left leg. Right leg parallel to the ground. Lean into the right fingertips and take that left arm and lift it up to the sky as you extend your heart forward, upward, and outward. And then you turn that left chest open, you reach that left arm up, and that back leg beautifully long and strong. Take a good by inhale there, and then exhale, left hand to the mat, crawl the hands forward, back, to the top of the mat, three-legged dog. Take an inhale here, right knee, right tricep, exhale. Inhale, right leg back, exhale, right knee, left arm cross. Inhale, right leg back, exhale, knee to the belly, hold for five, four, three, two, one. Right leg back, inhale, and then pigeon pose, swing. Your right leg all the way forward towards the top of your mat. Slide the weight back towards that back left leg. Get set in the hip so it's more about your front right hip getting a stretch than your front right knee. And then as you're ready, just begin to fold out over that right knee, right thigh. Pigeon pose stretch. Come back to the breath, moving in and out through the nose, keeping your mind on the breath and your breath on the mind. Now come up onto those hands, tuck the left toes underneath, lift that left knee up, thread the right leg all the way up into the air. Start to externally roll open through that right hip and the right knee, and then allow the right foot to fall gently onto the ground behind you. Flipping your dog upside down as you reach your right arm out, lift that navel up to the sky. So a little hybrid pose, you got an arm balance, Mix with the backward bend. Take one last inhale there. And then exhale, right hand to the ground. Roll back around to your downward facing dog. From down dog, slide forward to plank, upper push up. Inhale, chaturanga. Exhale, rise to plank. Two more, inhale. Exhale, press up. One more time, inhale. Exhale, rise, take an inhale there. And then down dog, exhale, hold there, big inhale through the nose. And out the mouth, exhale, let it go. Take an inhale, stretch back like a rubber band. 
Exhale, walker slingshot, top of the mat. Flat back, inhale, forward fold, exhale, bend the knees, chair pose, inhale, arms up, hands to prayer in front of the heart. This time, right elbow to the outer left knee, left thigh, chair twist, turning over to the left. Feel free to stay here, or if you're feeling like you want to explore that arm balance, side crow, fingers face the left. And as you're ready, floating, lifting those feet off the ground for five, four, three, two, and one. Feet on the ground. We all meet back. Chair pose, inhale, arms up. And exhale, forward fold. Flat back inhale, vinyasa on the exhale. Inhale, chest scoops up. Exhale, tailbone scoops up and back down dog. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left foot deep. Inhale, rise up, crescent pose. And then warrior two, turn and open up. Straighten your front left leg. Left foot turns in parallel to the right. Flick the heels in, point the toes out, horse stance. Take the left arm and slip it underneath and around that right arm for the eagle shoulder stretch. Take an inhale, lift the elbows up. This time we rotate over down to the left. And then inhale up the right. Exhale, two more of those. Inhale up. And exhale down. Inhale up, hold there. And then spread those arms back out wide. Reach those arms up, inhale. And then hands to prayer on the exhale. Extend the hands forward, open those out, inhale. Shoulder blades contract. And then exhale, palms reconnect. Two more, inhale. And exhale. One more time, inhale. And exhale, hold for the inhale. Straighten the legs, kick the heels out. Let those arms flow down and out. Turn the left toes forward, get the feet set. Inhale, reach out to that left arm. Triangle pose on the exhale. Keep the right arm lifted up into the sky. From here, start to bend that left knee, inhale. And then half moon, balancing on that left foot, left leg. Open up that right chest. Extended half moon, Uttita Ardha Chandrasana. Option to do a little double arm reach as you extend that left arm forward as well. Keep those right ribs rolling open to the sky. Keep driving back long and strong to your right leg. Good, you guys. Come back to warrior two. Soft landing. Reverse the warrior. Inhale. And then exhale. Cartwheel the hands down. Pivot on right toes, left leg back, three-legged dog. Crawl your hands back until your hands are about a foot, foot and a half or so in front of that right foot. Left leg stays parallel to the ground. And when you're ready, take that right arm, float it up for a twisting half moon. Parvrita Ardha Chandrasana. So in the same way that you're driving back to that left leg, extend your spine up and out, and then you turn into that twist. One more inhale there. Exhale, right hand down. Crawl the hands forward. Three-legged dog. Take an inhale there. Exhale, left knee, left arm. Inhale back. Exhale, cross, right tricep. Inhale back, exhale to the belly, hold five, four, three, two, 
One left leg back. Pigeon pose. Swing. Your left leg all the way forward and through. Get that body situated. Should feel sweet to fold out over top. That front leg. Climb up onto those hands, tuck the right toes underneath, draw the left leg back and up, externally open through the left hip, bend the left knee, and then flip that dog upside down, and you reach the left arm up and back. One last inhale, feel the peak of that wave, and then exhale, left hand down, left foot rolls back around, to our last down dog, there it is. Take an inhale, press back. Relax the knees down to the mat. Good, now go ahead and stand up on top of your two knees. Bring your hands to your hips, to your waist. And then you're going to extend your right leg straight out in front of you. Take both arms and open those out wide like a T. And then turn over to the right Make sure your left toes are tucked underneath your left foot as well. So the left heel lifts up. Turn over to the right. See if you can take your back right hand. Find that left heel. Now, start to take that left arm and reach it all the way back. And feel the whole front body opening up, especially your heart. And the Vedas, it says, let love radiate from your heart like light from a bonfire. So feel that light fully expressed and not suppressed. Extend the left arm forward, come back up into the twist, turn forward, both arms up, inhale, both hands to the hips, the waist on the exhale, second side, so right knee in, tuck the right toes underneath, Extend that left leg straight out in front of you. Arms wide. Start to rotate to the left. And then take that back left hand. Little balance there. Find that right heel. And then take that right arm. Bring it up and back as you rotate your chest up to the sky. Good, right arm forward, rise all the way back up, facing the left, turn forward, both hands to the hips, the waist, and then left leg comes back in, release the hands down, crawl your knees forward, top of your mat, release onto the sit bones, come down onto your back. Extend your left leg out towards straight, Right knee, right thigh, hugs in. Draw the right arm out to the right. And then allow the right knee to twist all the way over to the left. Right knee back up to neutral. Bring the left knee in to join the right. Extend the right leg forward. Open the left arm out to the left, and then take that left knee all the way over to the right. Left knee back up to center. Hug the knees, the thighs into the belly. One last inhale, goodbye, squeeze. And then exhale. Shavasana, release all the way down onto your back. 
taking a last minute or so here. Here, bring the knees and thighs back into the belly. Gently rock and roll your way up to a last seat. Both hands to prayer in front of the heart. May you live with a healthy body and mind. May you awaken the power inside. And may you live life with wisdom, purpose, and meaning. Stay empowered. Namaste. Thank you guys for your practice. I will see you tomorrow.